Okay, here we go now. Time to get this uh, wiring harness that I purchased on eBay. Cost me about 40 bucks, I think. Maybe even a little more. Very expensive just for a few pieces of wire, but they're the right pieces of wire. They've got the right connectors put on the end. Uh, it's all done. They don't have to worry about it. And uh, this is the way it will go. <clears throat> It's given me all the wires, which I think is nice. They gave this red one, which is uh, this replaces this wire here. And you can just see the colours where I've taken off the, uh, the sleeve that was on it. So these are much thicker wires, but that's okay. So now I'm going to do them, unsolder them, and uh, do them one at a time. A uh, little dab of uh, flux. The... Uh, solder um, take my time and do it slowly um, I would show you how to, to do the soldering um, and maybe I'll show one in a minute but uh, first and foremost I've got to prepare all the ends I've got to strip this off ready um, I do have to straighten this up this got bent at some point probably by me um, so I'm going to unsolder these two first and do these two wires first um, and then there is a paper uh, sleeve that goes on it. In fact, actually it goes on, on these two hooks So uh, I want to make sure of that and in fact, I must Clean the holes on the body which is over here um, the, And that body has been powder coated, but where it actually sticks through the holes uh, That's the other side. Whoops Let's Put that down there a second Through these two holes. I'm going to clean these holes out first because I want this to get a good uh, connection. Uh, I believe it needs it, so uh, that's, uh, that's what I should be doing, uh, cleaning these up and cleaning up these holes before I put this back in. And as I said, there is a, a piece of paper that goes over it, which is here. <coughs> Come on. This little piece here, unfortunately, is damaged, and I'm not sure whether I can just use another piece of uh, thin card. I'll give that some thought. Um, it does just go over this um, to stop the rest of it shorting out. So I've got to put something there and uh, I'm not sure exactly yet what I'm going to do. But I'll figure that out before I put it all together. Thanks very much. So I unsoldered the, uh, the wire from down here. Um, Unfortunately, with the wiring harness, it didn't come with this little thin, short one here. Um, then I got the two new wires together and uh, gave them a quick solder. And now my job is to take this out of here. <laughs> and solder it on there. And then once I've done that, then I will be soldering this um, green wire back onto the uh, other connection there so uh, as you saw it just fell off because of my brilliant soldering so I'm going to make sure I do that better this is going to be fun um, as I said this is not my expertise I am not a soldering person so the next one I should do will be this red and black one here but I really want to get this on here of course that's going to be right in the way well, I know where it goes there, so maybe, uh, there ain't no maybe about it, I should solder this on here with this wire here, so these two reds, so these two on here. That's what I'll do. I'll be back. Right, uh, I have soldered these two wires together. They're going to go on here, so now my next task is to unsolder this and then solder these two wires on. I keep mentioning, I know, I am no fucking expert in soldering. So there you go. Alright, I have realised that this soldering iron I have is part of my problem. It's really not what I need for what I'm trying to do so I'm off to Harbour Freight to get myself a decent soldering iron and a couple of other things that I need because you can't just buy one thing in Harbour Freight 
And I did actually manage to get these two wires on here, which was a fucking miracle. And I've put these two back together. And the next thing is to solder them back onto here. But unfortunately, with that soldering iron that I've got, it, it, there's not a fucking snowball's chance in hell. <laughs> because, well, one, I'm not very good at it, as I keep mentioning. And the other is that um, that thing is it's kind of cumbersome. So uh, let's uh, go get a soldering iron and uh, come back and let's see what we can do. All right. Uh, just to uh, give the final update on this uh, windshield, windscreen, wiper motor. Um, first of all, let me say, I did this video just now with uh, what I'm about to say, but I had the camera on my head backwards, so all you would have seen was the ceiling. I guess that wouldn't have been too interesting. Not that this may be interesting, but uh, there you go. I have now finished doing all of the wires. I've done all the soldering. Uh, the joints are not perfect, but uh, they seem to be holding up, so I'll give them all a wiggle before I put it all in. Uh, I've got to get all the wires now neatly together and put uh, shrink wrap on them. That will be interesting. Um, here are the old bullet connectors. Um, I've got some new ones. I'll probably use the new ones and just put these uh, as spares somewhere. These are the old wires that I've uh, taken out. And they're all done and dusted. Um, do note that on the green wire you use this double connector. Um, that, I believe, is because there is a loop that um, is on the harness. But that we will see you know, when I get the car back. Um, so that will be later. Um, I'm going tomorrow to actually see the body um, and how that's progressing. So I'll try and do a short video on that. That should be um, kind of interesting, to say the least. Uh, I know he's progressing well. Um, unfortunately, he has been very ill. So, uh, you know, progress did stop for a while, but uh, now he's getting back into it, which is great. And uh, when it's all done, of course, I will do a video on it. All right, um, also one other thing that I'm um, going to mention is that um, I'm going to be dismantling the seats. Uh, that'll be in a few weeks time I'll be doing that. So do make sure you subscribe and ding that bell and then you'll see me taking the seats apart. I could um, just, you know, use a knife and cut everything off because it's all gonna be replaced anyway. And it's, I'm, I'm actually having that done professionally because uh, Getting it right um, is is a job and a half, and I, I want it to look good. Uh, so I shall be going to California, um, to BAS in California, and uh, putting all the seats in the back of my truck and driving to California. And if all goes well, um, I'll be going with my brother. Um, but that will probably not be for a couple of months yet. Um, but I will be taking the seats apart, and once I've got them all apart, uh, taking them down to the powder coater and getting him to powder coat them. Again, that's going to be a little while, but I uh, just wanted to uh, give you a bit of a teaser. That's what's going to be coming up on my channel. All right, um, as always, guys, please like, comment, subscribe. Send me an email if you want to at gstargarage at gmail.com. And as I always say, that is star with two R's. Uh, was my father's name. So uh, there you go, guys and girls. Especially girls. You're nice. I like girls. All right. Keep your pecker up. Get out in that garage and do some shit. Yeah.